so I haven't gotten to say this in forever, but welcome to the vlogs! Today we are going to the wedding of two of my favorite people. My friend from college, Jess, is marrying her fiance, Zach. Um, I've known them both forever. I've known Zach since um, he started dating Jessica like our senior year of college. And I've known Jessica since freshman year. So this is gonna be so fun. I've never been to a wedding like without my parents before. So it's gonna be so weird. And plus it's like my first time out since like COVID. So I'm gonna take you guys with me. Um, we're going to New Jersey. And then I'm checking into the hotel and then I will just take you guys with me to get ready. I probably won't bring my camera to the actual wedding, but I will vlog on my phone. I'm so excited. Ah! Jersey for Jess and Zach's wedding. But first, an unboxing. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Jessica and Zach. Can you see it? No, now you can. Yay! They gave us a little water, a little hangover recovery kit, and just some snacks and another water, which we know I will be needing. So I spared you guys me blow drying my hair um, because that's like so boring. But we are gonna do some makeup and chit chat a little bit. I know I have like one more of these, but like I just don't know where. So, hmm. I'm sort of doing this in a regular barrette. I'm gonna adjust this. I make it taller. I'm such a new. Okay, I think that works. I'm just like in my pajama shirt while I'm getting ready for this wedding, um, which I'm actually super anxious about because I've never been to a wedding um, on my own. I've only ever been to weddings with my family, so I have kind of like a built-in like support system. And I just have really bad anxiety in general. Um, most of it is stemmed from like social like stuff. I'm also the only single person that I know coming to this wedding. Like I'm sure there are other single people. But like everyone I know is here with their boyfriends, which like I'm so happy for them. But it's sad for me because I had to like literally text people and be like, hey, like can we sit together at the ceremony? Because like I don't want to like just sit by myself. Oh, I have to wear my beauty blender. You know, and like this wedding, I'm so excited for because it's like one of my best friends from college. But I feel like most people don't realize that like. When you grow up, like not that like being 27 is like a full bloom grown up, but when you grow up, like it's a lot harder to keep in touch with friends, which I definitely did not realize like going into like the real world. Like I thought I was gonna hang out with my college friends like every single day, but I see them like once every couple months, which is so sad. And like, I need this real mirror. I really just like, I don't know, I'm like super anxious, like I love them, but like I'm just still anxious and I just like don't know how to handle this level of anxiety. And I feel like this beauty blender is not giving me as much coverage as I want. Oh, I've also never done like my makeup for like a real event. Like I do with my everyday makeup, but I, ha I came to New Jersey and they don't have like, um, they don't have Glam Squad here, so I'm doing my own hair and makeup which is super interesting, especially post COVID vibes because I've only done super light makeup looks for like the past year and a half. So like, let's see if this works. It might be a little too hard for me to do my makeup and talk to you guys, but we're gonna figure it out. So maybe I'll do like a little quick vibes while I, while I definitely need more foundation. Like this is just not, this is not it. I need more coverage. I need to look beautiful. Maybe pick up a man's. So like, I don't know. It's a black tie vibe. And I've only ever been to one black tie wedding. So I feel like I need to go full glam 
and that will definitely require some more focus on my part so we'll do like a little you know quick vibe fast forward moment cue the tapes <laughs> I just remembered I'm doing like glitter on my eyes so I shouldn't have done my base first like my foundation so I'm going to stop here and then go in with my eyes I'm doing this Stila glitter shadow it's like super pretty should I be like a youtuber focus and it's in the shade bronze spell with a um a brown liquid liner um wing this is the Stila in dark brown and I'm going to go with some of my ride or die falls lashes I put these on last weekend for like photo shoots with the gals um so like that was some practice so hopefully like it goes well but again back to rolling the tapes <laughs> I knew I was gonna get glitter everywhere. I don't know if you can see. Let's try a little zoom magic. I don't know how to use this. Oh, oh, we're zooming. Can you see? Glitter everywhere, yeah. So, that's it. So yeah, it's a good thing I didn't continue on with my makeup on my face, because that's what I need to be fixed. I just got sent this versed, um, they dissolve cleansing balm. So I've been using it for a couple days and I actually really like it. Like it's an oil, but it just took off like my entire base. So like I'm definitely gonna need a redo. People are walking in the hallway of the hotel and they hear me talking to myself. And they think I'm probably crazy. But whatever, I don't care sisters. Now the most stressful part for me, the liquid liner. <laughs> I just killed that eye. Woo! That's stunning. All right, it's not awful, but it's also really not cute. I feel like I need to go call my mom and get her opinion. Let me look at my phone. Before I move on, oh shit, are you golfing? Not yet. Um, before I move on, do my eyes look even, like eyeliner wise? Yes. Okay, I always suck at this eye and I'm vlogging right now. Say hi to the vlog. I'm vloggers. Um, and I like need to, and I like, couldn't focus, but they look good. I need to go in with the lashes and then do my whole face. Yeah, they look good. Uh, there they are. Okay. Now the other side. <laughs> Breathe. Like this is so tragic. Like I got my nails done. They're my natural nails, but I got like gels and then my thumb decided to like fuck everything up. I can't believe I have to redo my foundation after this. Concealer. I use Revlon. I use a lot of um, drugstore makeup. I just find that like it works the same. It's less expensive. And like makes my life easier because like if it expires, like I don't really worry about like, I'm saying like so much. I don't really have to worry about spending an arm on a leg every time I need new makeup. The rest of my makeup's pretty basic, so I'm just gonna speed through it and then we will show you the final product. First round of all-nighter setting spray. I did not blend my neck enough. Oof. Excuse me, I burped. Now I'm gonna bronze this bitch up, which, and I'll end my bronzer probably before I leave. I really never do my makeup for like big events, like I always get it done. So like, this is huge for me, but I knew um, I had to like get a hotel room for tonight and I just like 
I had to like draw the line somewhere, you know, like be some sort of a budgeting queen. Here that I said budgeting queen and they're gonna laugh so hard at me because that's like the farthest thing that I've ever been, ever. But you gotta do what you gotta do. Um, what else does this look need? Oh, my brows. Duh. Obviously. I wish I had like a full pencil vibe to go with, but I just passed my benefit. It'll be fine because I didn't clean my face this morning and I kind of shaved like some unibrow off. So my brows should be relatively neat and even. I also, I cut my nose dermaplaning like a fucking fool. Final step for me is mascara to like bring together my lashes and my extensions. And I don't do lower eye mascara. I did a lot when I was younger. But now I really think that it makes my eyes look smaller. So I try and stay away from it. So yeah, this is the final look. This is the final fit. I'm wearing a dress by Aqua. My extensions are, insert name here, and you saw my makeup look. And my earrings are just like ratchet as hell. And then, this is it for the vlog, I think. Um, maybe I'll vlog in the morning if I'm not like so hungover. But yeah. A special thanks to the setting queen, Jess Cohen, who let me break into her apartment and seal her bag. Let's go party. I'm up and um, can't find good light mm. last night was so fun I literally had the best time ever um, and now I'm gonna get ready for the brunch but I'm gonna sign off here thank you for back coming back thank you for coming back to the vlogs make sure to like comment and subscribe give it a thumbs up I think that's what I'm supposed to say um, and yeah can't wait to Pick this back up and learn how to use this new camera, so.